Did you guys like that intro? Hey, so today I'm going to be doing things a little different. I'm going to be baking a pumpkin chocolate chip bread from scratch. I thought it'd be perfect because, you know, Halloween's coming up, Thanksgiving's coming up, and Christmas is coming up. And this is like festival food, you know? I've never made it, so hopefully it tastes okay. But I already put the pumpkin in the oven so I can puree it later. And I took out all the seeds. Can you see this? Right, and I already cleaned them all out. They're super slimy, but I'm gonna make them into like a little snack. First thing, ooh, it's dripping, is to clean them all off. And we're gonna, you're supposed to like wait a little longer, like let them dry out on their own. But no one got time for that, so I'm gonna spread them all out. And yes, I wash my hands. And I'm gonna get another napkin, super casual. And I'm gonna dry him out myself. My pumpkin pie. We'll put this the organic virgin coconut oil from Trader Joe's. And right now it's solid, so I'm gonna I think a spoonful like this is enough. And then I'm gonna just put it in. Here. Put it in the oven, in the microwave. Now that it's all melted, I'm just gonna pour it on top like this. Not too much. Sugar all over these bad boys. There probably is a way better method to doing this, but I'm just Go with the flow. So, oh my gosh. Okay. Now I'm gonna put this in the oven. Toaster oven. A little bit in there, and then. Okay, so we're gonna wait for that to cook. The pumpkins are still cooking. Pumpkin's still cooking, but I'll come back with everything set up once the pumpkins are done. So I'll see you guys soon.
perfect. We'll put all the ingredients together. The pumpkin's finally done. The puree's finally done. So I'm gonna put it all together and then I'll show you guys the end result. All right, let's do this. Now that I'm waiting for everything to be done, I'll show you guys a little behind the scenes of baking. Because you know, when people make baking videos, they never show the mess. But like, look at this shit. And this is how I make my top view. For any of you who are curious, it's my little ratchet setup. I got a little shoe rack. Uh, Cause you know, when you're poor and you don't got legit stuff, this is what you gotta make do, right? And this is all the pumpkin and this and I have to clean it so yeah I'll see you guys back when it's done and hopefully it tastes good just finished making the pumpkin bread I switched my camera back to my phone because the GoPro was kind of a hassle but I'm gonna cut it and then see how it tastes <clears throat> I'm super excited this is the final piece, and I think it turned out really well. <laughs> Guys, this is actually really good. I always eat the top last because I like to save the best for last. And trust me. And also, I burn them. I put these in for way too long, but if it wasn't burned, it would be really good too. I'm gonna get a cup of milk and finish all of this, but it turned out really well, so check out the link. That's where I got the recipe. And make it yourself and let me know how it turned out. Okay, thanks for watching.